वेलकम टू माई न्यू एपिसोड टूडे विल बी मेकिंग दही कड़ी माई दही कड़ी इज अ मिक्सचर ऑफ पंजाबी कड़ी एंड गुजराती कड़ी बोथ द वे वी पार्स इज नॉर्मली मेक एट होम फॉर दैट आई हैव फाइव हंड्रेड ग्राम्स ऑफ योग सॉल्ट टू टेस्ट आई हेव गट ऑयल ओवर इयर ऑयल इज अबाउट टू tablespoon my all time favorite onions fried onions fried onions are about 3 thick eating spoons we'll be using a little sugar in it then we'll be using gram flour one and a half eating spoon full then half a teaspoon of haldi or turmeric half a teaspoon of chili powder and half a teaspoon of garam masala we will also use half a teaspoon of hing or asafoetida over here i have ginger garlic paste if you want you can chop ginger and garlic separately i have got one teaspoon full i have taken two green chilies depending on how spicy you want you can take more you can take less along with that i have taken about 8 peppercorns 1 teaspoon of uh, mustard seeds or rai i have taken 1 eating spoon full of kasuri methi and say about 10 to 12 curry powder we switch on our stove or hot plate to full and add the oil first we take the yogurt and put the gram flour to do it we add one measuring cup water into it and with a small whisk whisk it all together you can see the gram flour is totally mixed it to it properly see to it that there are no clumps left inside after doing this since our oil is hot First, we put the mustard seeds and the black pepper in it. Along with that, we add the ginger garlic paste, the green chilies, and. the curry powder let it cook for a little while when it cooks for some time we take half a teaspoon of asafoetida and add to it Then we take half a teaspoon of garam masala, half a teaspoon of haldi, and half a teaspoon of chili powder. Mix it all well. Add. the kasuri methi to it after frying the masala for a little while you add your fried onions into it or if you don't want to use fried onions start up by frying fresh onions then put all this masala into it and add 
the yogurt which you have prepared along with the chaneka atta or the gram flour. You mix this all well. Add salt to taste. Don't add too much of salt. Just a little bit. And we shall add to this, say about two spoons, eating spoons of sugar. Now to this, we shall give a small squeeze of lemon. And since we have added gram flour to it, it will thicken up, thicken up a little more. That is why we add one measuring cup of water to it again. Now give it a nice boil, let it boil properly. But before that we taste it for salt, sourness, spiciness, sugar. Well, it requires a little more sugar. So we just add a little more sugar to it. And for the spiciness now, we shall add not the chili powder, but a little bit of white pepper into it and mix it well. Now when this boils nicely, after adding the pepper and sugar you can taste it but according to me I feel it is absolutely perfect. At the end we add freshly chopped coriander into it and switch off the flame. This curry you can have with khichdi or just plain yellow rice. So friends, do make this, it doesn't take much time and it is a lovely dish to have. Till the next time that we meet again, bye bye, au revoir and off we does it.